Scottish Terrier The Scottish Terrier, popularly known as the Scotty, is a breed of small terrier dogs. One of several breeds from the Scottish Highlands, it was originally bred to kill rodents on farms and to hunt foxes and badgers over the tough terrain of the region. All terriers from Scotland being termed Scottish Terriers for many years makes it difficult to figure out the exact early history of the breed. Though there are early records from the 15th and 16th centuries, proper documentation of the breed begins only from the 1800s, when the rough-haired variety of the terrier was clearly identified as the Scottish Terrier, as against the smooth-haired English Terrier, and a pure bloodline began to be developed. Setting up of Scottish Terrier clubs in England and Scotland, and increasing participation in dog shows, helped further breeding across set standards. In the US, the Scottish Terriers really caught on in the years between the two world wars, and has remained a popular show dog and pet. Time for some rough trivia. One of the most famous US presidential pets was a Scottish Terrier called Fala. Which of these presidents had it in the White House during his term? A. F. D. Roosevelt B. Jimmy Carter or C. George H. W. Bush? What do you think? Give it your best guess in the comments below before we get to the answer. Hang on tight and we'll get back to this rough trivia question toward the end of the video. The average height of an adult Scottish Terrier is 10 to 11 inches. Weight range for the male is 19 to 22 pounds and for the female is 18 to 21 pounds. Its double coat is made up of a soft, dense undercoat and a hard, wiry outer coat. The coat is slightly softer on the beard, legs and lower body. Colors range from dark grey to jet black and brindle. Scotties with straw to nearly white shades are rarer. The typical features are its thick set body, short legs, erect ears and tail, and a keen expression known as the varminty expression. Grooming The Scotty's coat requires a brush two or three times a week and an occasional bath to keep it clean. It also needs shaping once every two to three months, which is done by clipping for a pet dog and by stripping for a show dog. Trimming of nails and brushing of teeth have to be regular. Environment the Scottish Terrier is an independent and self-assured breed, because of which it is sometimes considered to be aloof. The dog is definitely reserved with strangers, but generally very friendly and devoted to its family. It is also very good with children. It can be aggressive with other dogs and pets, unless socialized early on. Most Scotties have a natural tendency to dig and look for vermin. Training Scotties are very spirited in nature, which requires early obedience training. Daily walks or a boisterous game are needed to keep its physical exercise needs satisfied. Walks should always be on a leash to control the dog's urge to give chase to small animals. But if you can provide it a safe, fenced-in area to explore, it will be very happy. Health Scottish Terriers have a life expectancy of 11 to 13 years. Two genetic disorders seen commonly in the breed are von Wildebrand disease and craniomandibular osteopathy. Other common ailments can be kneecap dislocation, some eye-related disorders, skin conditions, and cancer. Scotty cramp is a breed-specific issue caused by hormonal imbalance that keeps the dog from walking properly. The Scottish Terrier is a fearless and feisty animal, perfect for apartment living. If you are fine with living with a dog that is not needy and prefers being treated as an equal, you will never look at another pet once you have given the Scotty a chance. Find out if the Scottish Terrier would be a good addition to your home. Let's get back to the answer to a rough trivia question. Fala was a Scottish Terrier owned by President F.D. Roosevelt. The dog is buried beside President Roosevelt and even has a statue of his own at the F.D. Roosevelt Memorial in Washington, D.C. That does it for the Scottish Terrier. If you enjoyed this Dog Facts 101 video, be sure to subscribe and paw that thumbs up button. Then go ahead and check out some of our other videos or fun activities on our website. Thanks for watching and we'll see you soon.